Hey everyone, Mr. Sujano here. In this video, we're taking a look at an online save converter for your emulators. Let's get started. All right, to kick things off, if you're looking to convert some save files you have to work on an emulator, well, this website will probably have you covered. It's called savefileconverter.com. It's free and it's perfectly safe. In fact, it's completely open source. Now this site has a ton of different systems to choose from, and if I'm not mistaken, they're going to be adding even more. One thing I really appreciate about this site is that they've listed where to get your downloaded saves from. If you don't have your own saves, yes, you can pull them from the internet. One of my favorite sites is GameFAQs. In this video, I'm going to convert a PS1 Dex Drive file just to show you how this process works. Now, I don't have a Dex Drive file. I will have to download one off GameFAQs. So we're over here on GameFAQs. The game I'm downloading the save files for is Street Fighter EX2+. Plus. And if you take a look here, there are a ton of different save files. And I'm looking for the PlayStation Dex Drive save file from North America, considering the version of the game I'm using is from USA. I have three different options. One here is all characters and modes unlocked, expert and maniac mode completed. The second one here, all characters unlocked, training modes completed, special modes unlocked, maniac mode fully completed. And the third one here says unlock everything. So let's just take the middle one and see how that goes. So I've got the save file downloaded. I'm back on savefileconverter.com and I'm gonna click on PS1 Dex Drive because that's the file we're converting here. And then under Dex Drive, I have the option to select Browse and I'm gonna select it and find the file that I just downloaded. Once you select the game file, you should see some stuff populate on the website. I can see the game listed under where my file is. And on the right hand side, I see individual saves and raw emulator. I'm gonna click raw emulator here because I wanna convert this to work on an emulator. I'm not looking for the individual saves. Once you have raw emulator clicked, just click convert. Now that is pretty much it. I was debating whether or not to show importing a save file into an emulator, but to be honest with you, the process will vary from emulator to emulator. Some emulators do have quirks. I recommend checking out the website of whatever emulator you're trying to use and reading a how-to guide on there because they can be helpful. I'd also recommend checking out Reddit groups for that particular emulator or even the Discord groups because again, there can be some helpful people there. Anyways, that is all I've got for this video. Let me know your thoughts about Save File Converter in the comments below. Are you going to use it? Are you not going to use it? And if you are going to use it, what games are you gonna use it for? If I had to guess, if you're on PS1, it would probably be something like Gran Turismo, but that's more or less just a shot in the dark. Let me know anyways in the comments below. If you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't like this video, leave a like. Hit that subscribe button, check out my other videos. Thank you everyone, take care.